Tonight, medical researchers are excited about what could be a new weapon in the battle against Alzheimer's disease. For the first time, they have developed a blood test that may be able to predict whether someone will get the disease. That could lead to earlier and more effective treatment. We asked Dr. John LaPook to tell us more. Okay, 15 here. 84-year-old Cappy Friedman watched her mother, two sisters, and a brother all develop Alzheimer's. She wonders if she's next. I'm very, very concerned. I've had to watch, you know, three siblings die from this dreadful disease. Friedman and her boyfriend, 82-year-old Bob Bressler, enrolled in a study looking to see if a simple blood test could help predict her future. The study followed 525 people aged 70 and older. After three years, 53 patients were diagnosed with either Alzheimer's or early dementia. When analyzing the blood of those 53 patients, Researchers found a group of 10 lipids, or fats, that were at lower levels than in healthy patients. Dr. Howard Fedorov of Georgetown University is the lead author. We had individuals who also were enrolled who were cognitively normal, and we wanted to know whether the blood test, the 10 lipid panel, would predict their cognitive impairment. It did. Researchers tested the stored blood of 10 people who were initially normal but developed dementia over three years. Nine of the 10 tested positive. If this is validated, what are the implications of the work? We have a basis on finding very uh, uh, much at-risk individuals, which has never existed before. Bob Bressler and the other participants were not told the results, a condition of taking part in the study. If a test becomes available, he would want to get it. If I have some disease, even though I couldn't be cured, I would certainly want to know about it. Dr. Fedorov says this work needs to be duplicated in other labs and with a larger number of patients. They did find two false positive results among 20 healthy patients and are working on ways of refining the test to make it more accurate. A little progress all the time. Thank you.